My name is Kaylee Sayers and I am the daughter of Chris and Steve Sayers. I joined CIS in second grade. I remember um, doing fast facts in second and third grade, or second grade. I remember doing fast facts in second grade and I remember learning how to do multiplication and it blew my mind. <laughs> I think academically, um, I had a really tough math class my junior year. So yeah, that, um, yeah, that was challenging. Um, my teacher, Miss Bullard, she was really, really supportive and really, um, she didn't simplify it for me at all. She knew that if, um, if I was going to struggle with it, I was going to struggle with it until I understood it. But she did everything in her power to help me understand it and that really helped. Well, this year I started my fellowship and I started the Lionheart program, which is a mentorship between upper and lower schoolers. and. It's really rewarding to see the friendships that have grown between the high school and the lower school students who participate. Um, CIS has been really great during the college search process. Um, Ms. Bucco, who is our college counselor, has been really hands-on with us and like all the resources that she's given us and that CIS has provided has been really helpful. And the thing that drew me most to St. Michael's was how much that they wanted me to be at their college, like they sent an email a day for a long time, like just kind of sending updates about what's going on at their college right now and different things that they do um, with their students and I think that really drew me towards that college and um, I got it narrowed down to Mizzou and St. Michael's and ultimately I, I chose St. Michael's. Um, as of right now, I'm majoring in English. I've always really loved writing and reading. Um, I was a huge reader when I was from age like five to 12. I read all the time. And I started to transition more into writing and enjoying writing. And Ms. Bucco, who has been my English teacher for the past three years, has been a really great mentor to me and um, a really supportive teacher. And I think she really kind of encouraged me to follow that and um, yeah, and follow my strength, so. I've been reminiscing a lot um, with my classmates about like the adventures we've been on over the past four plus years because we've all known each other since at least sixth grade. Um, so just kind of going back and looking at pictures and videos and um, I keep a running quote book for our grade and just going through those has been really something that we've been doing a lot and I think just reminiscing and looking back on everything that we've done together is kind of how we're coping with moving forward. I think really pay attention to what you want out of your high school experience. If if the close-knit environment and um, teachers knowing who you are and kind of knowing everything about who you are as a student is important to you, then I think seriously consider staying at CIS. Um, I think it's a really great place to make lifelong friends and not just friends for high school. Um, but you know, it also depends on everyone's personality and everyone is different in what they prefer to get out of their high school experience. So just really pay attention to what you want and not what your friends want because your high school experience is gonna be yours forever and you don't wanna experience someone else's high school experience. You wanna, you wanna live what you want to live.